Hey, what's up guys? Techman95 here, and today uh, I will be bringing you my new computer, which is right here. The full build, uh, like what's in it, and I hope you all are having a new, uh, happy New Year's. I am, for sure, and so let's get right into it. Starting off with the case here, this is just a simple Rosewell. I don't even remember the exact name. I can tell you in a second, but it's just a standard Rosewell case with a 400 watts power supply, and uh, yeah, that's what's powering the whole build. With the motherboard, I went with an H110MA. It's a pretty basic motherboard, uh, but I chose it because it would accept my uh, Intel Core i3-6100 and the 8GB of DDR4 RAM, so I thought it would be perfect. You know, it's basic and it supports exactly what I need it to. I went with the GeForce GTX 1050 Ti, 4GB overclocked edition. Um, I'm sure some of you may have already known this from my previous videos, but it's a pretty powerful graphics card that can run any game in 1080p, uh, usually max settings, it depends on what else you have backing it up. Uh, I can run the games I've had at max settings, 1080p, 60 p uh, frames per second and over so far, so those have all worked perfectly well. And I'm installing Doom, and I'm going to see how that works with it too. With Windows 10 as the operating system, uh, so this could support 32 or 64 bit. It was came on a USB, and that's what I used. And for the hard drive, I don't actually have a. All that came in was a cardboard box. It was a one terabyte to see to wow, one terabyte uh, hard drive that had a 7200 7, uh, spindle speed. So I went with that. Uh, it had pretty decent speeds. It boots Windows, you know, pretty fast, and I'm happy with it. I need internet, of course, so I went with the TP-Link uh, wireless dual-band PCI Express adapter. This uh, will give me internet, a uh, second of power on that computer, uh, so that was, you know, pretty handy, came in handy, and uh, yeah. And the processor, some of you know, Intel Core i3-6100. This is uh, what a lot of people say is, you know, one of the best budget gaming CPUs, and uh, I've been happy with it so far. The installation was really easy with it too. Also got a disk drive, didn't really come with a box either, so I got this little CD. Drivers, yeah! Decided since I'm going all out with a whole new thing, I'd get a new mouse as well. I want the Razer Death Adder uh, Essential Edition. And uh, I've been really happy with it. The grip is really nice on it, and uh, it has really good, you know, tracking when you're moving the mouse. Finally, I want the Red Dragon Kumara Mechanical Gaming Keyboard. Uh, this one shows red LED backlighting, but I went with a standard edition one that didn't have backlighting uh, because it didn't really match my setup because my setup's, you know, blue. Neither does the green mouse, but uh, the only other blue mouse in Razer would have been like a left-handed one. Uh, so I didn't really want that, of course. So, yeah. So, yeah, that's been my video on my new computer. I've been pretty pleased with it. And, uh, yeah, hopefully I didn't forget any of the parts. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, that's all set. Uh, you can see here I'm installing some Doom. Doom! But, yeah, so thank you all for watching. Hope you have a great New Year's. I'll catch you again in another video on this piece of garbage.